I've received this medal. I've waited for more than 10 years. As an athlete, uh, seriously, I was bit bitter because some of my friends who were together at the Olympics were given maybe even promotion at their workstations. Yeah, I am a cop. And for that reason, I trained for more than four years to go to Olympics. So going to uh, train for four years and then you get nothing was actually it was a big, uh, big uh, bitterness in me. But all the same, I tell athletes, run clean. Look at this corner. I have received this medal. I have worked as a cop. Discipline. I'm working in the National Police College. Yes. Gigante. And I'm happy. So, um, uh, where have you been? Because you've not been in athletics for some time since you made history, winning, um, uh, uh, I mean, uh, giving us our first Olympic title 2008 and then on to 2012 Olympics. Where have you been? Okay, first of all, uh, maybe that is the problem, guys, because I'm available. I am available. I am a cop. I work as a teacher, instructor in a National Police College. And... Uh, so far, I'm mentoring other athletes. I'm also working as a coach. Yes. Yes. Okay. Let's talk about um, Kenyan athletics. You know, like Kidogo in the Chile. What are you? What is your take? You think to Mexico Kidogo or to come and to be poor? I think. Uh, I think Kenyan athletics is. No, I, I don't have to say it is down, but I want to say let at, uh, athletics be clean. When athletics is clean, everybody will will come up. Yes. No matter the time, but uh, maybe training well, eating well, and uh, focusing will make athletics a great again. People say you quit athletics early. What is your take? I have never quit athletics. I am also competitive, I, I've told competition, you, I've told rather you, competition. I don't have to be coerced. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> At the moment, people believe like if I, you take maybe medicine, you take drugs, you go, you come tomorrow and win. But take time to train. Yes, run clean. Yes, I believe in uh, clean sport. Yes. Do, 